My Walden people, welcome to the wild world of Farley. Let's get it, stay wildin'. What's up my wild and people? Welcome to another episode of Wild World of Farley with your boy Farley. Alright guys, so my last episode, guys, Artemis. Artemis is no longer with us. My dragonfish, my arowana, my albino arowana. Ooh, I miss that fish so much. But guys, that's the fish keeper's worst nightmare, but it's part of the actual hobby. Unfortunately, Artemis isn't here anymore, but uh, I had a great time watching him grow. Great time training him. I just love that fish. But guys, when one door closes, another door opens. So enough of me talking. Let's get right into this, and of course, let's get it. All right, my wild people. So guess what? My boy Tank Diaz. Hey, what's up? What's up, guys? Yeah, yeah. Come on, more energy than that. Come on, you're the wild world of Farley. Yeah, he just woke up. Yeah, bro. Literally just woke up. I was waiting for Farley all day, bro. Praying all day. It's this morning, guys. It's morning, guys. It's like what? Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Something I was like that. up to like three, bro. A little excited, just a little excited. I got you, I got you. <laughs> All right, guys. So we got some surprise for me. So let's see what it is. All right, Farley. So. I got, I got something for you. You got something for me? Yeah. Uh, all right, all right. My boy hit me up. He told me he had a surprise. Let's see what he has. All right. This is a nice tank. How big is this? Yeah, bro. This is 220. You give me the tank? Oh. I need something for my puffer fish. Tank? Yeah. No, bro. It's a, it's a little something uh, <laughs> special for you, especially, bro. This albino arrow. You're lying. This is the brother of the one that you recently just lost, bro. For, you're for real, for real? Yeah. 100%? 100%. But at the same time, you, Zach, and Joey all got theirs. But I felt bad for you, bro. I wasn't going to go for my pond, but yeah. I was like, you know what? He's going to go to a great home. Like, I'm just going to give him a Farley, bro. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. But wait, wait, wait. You're saying this is the same one that was, like, in the same batch? Same one, same batch. Same Yo, batch. have you been feeding him? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding guys. That's the difference between having a pond and actually having a tank. For some, it's something about those ponds, fresh flowing water, constant fresh flowing water in bigger spaces allows them to just blow up. As you guys saw, Artemis, my arowana, he was about 20, 23 inches before he passed. Yeah. Oh my god, I don't even know what to say. I'm so thankful. Yo, I'm so excited. What else do you have in here? Bro, I also have an Indo tarpon. Alright. This guy, when I got him, he looked like a sardine. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. That is massive. Yeah, oh my god, yeah, he's pretty big. That thing is massive. Are you trying to rehome that too? Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna go with you too, bro. My boy Joey Slam would love this right now. He has a tarpon right now, and I know this is gonna go perfect with the tarpon he currently has. Alright, let's make it happen. I appreciate you, brother. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so we got the supplies we need, guys. When you're transporting fish, you always want to make sure to be able to accommodate them. I have coolers and I have buckets and I have aeration. Somewhere in my car. All right, let's take a closer look at this arowana, guys. Oh my god. What a surprise. Just like I told you guys, when one door closes, another one opens. Oh, it's so gorgeous. All right, we're going to feed this guy a lot. Make sure he's nice and big. Let's take a look at the tarpon. Where's the... Oh. All right, there's also something very special in this tank that what? I love truly the most. You guys see that in the back? Yeah, we see it. What is That's that? That's a bristlenose placo. I actually bred that fish. I had... How'd you do that? I had four females and two males. So what happened was they were all super, super tiny yeah. flies. Yeah, yeah. And somehow he was the only one that made it. I had a whole batch of like four or five albinos out of that same batch. That's crazy. It was crazy. But they all got seemed to get sucked up into the filter. Oh, that was not guy, good. He survived. I filter, dude, and there was so many inside, but this guy survived. He it's survived. It's already been... Two years and he's that big. You have a YouTube video about it? At all. Guys, if you didn't know, my boy Tank Diaz right here, he has a YouTube channel. Subscribe to his channel. What are you waiting for? Yeah, bro, some fire content on there. You guys should definitely check it out. Yeah, yeah. Actually got the water ready to go. Got it straight from the tank. Literally just did a water change a little while ago. Um, okay. It shouldn't harm the fish at all. But it's about the same temperature as the same as the well water. And we did put a little bit of water from the tank. That's why it's so low right now. Mm. And we put it in there, so we don't want to hurt him either. Sounds good. Alright guys, let's try to catch the arowana. Okay. Oh, he's right there. Get him for you again. Oh my god, I missed it. I failed this off. Oh my god. He's in that corner. Cool. Bring him closer, bring him closer. The corner on Farley, you got this bro. Okay, guys. Get down a little bit. <laughs> Ah. 
Nice and gentle, nice and easy. Scoop! Got him! Ah, you missed! Go back! Go back! Oh. <laughs> okay, okay. Scoop! Scoop! Save the life! Nice and gentle, nice and gentle. We got him, we got him, we got him. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Oh my god, he's... Oh. I'm stuck on the net. I'm stuck on the net. Ah. I'm stuck on the net. <laughs> Just throw the net out. Just throw it. Just okay, throw okay, it. We're good. We're good. Is good. We're good. Let's drop it slowly. Not the least. Ooh. No stress. Oh easy God. peasy. Look how pretty he is, that guys. Is Look at that. Wanna. Look at him. Oh, my God. Oh. That is really beautiful. Oh, it hurts me, dude. I but you just, got a goal, dude. This one's not going to jump out. I've made a lot of different plans, a lot of different up upgrades to my pond. So you guys will see. He's in good hands. What'd you name him? I didn't name him anything. All right, guys, I lost. this is Artemis II. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Out here breathing there, chilling. About to put the aerator soon. But in the meantime, we got one fish down. We got one more to go. Yeah, I don't know why. This guy, is, he's a, a very type of corner arowana. His favorite was that little corner. That one. <laughs> I don't know why. That means they like to jump. This is like deja vu. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, let's get the tarpon. Oh, he's already over here. Not gonna get far. If you scoot him into this corner, you're perfect. I failed. Oh, he's coming! He's coming! He's coming! Uh -oh. There he is. That's it. Dunzo. Oh my God! Look how oh, fat he is, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a big one. Okay, perfect. We got him where we need him. There you go. Now you got him. Got him! Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh! Okay. <laughs> Alright, guys, that's nasty well water. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Oh man. Those are beautiful. Two beautiful fish, man. My Look at that. Is Bro, right. He's gotten thick from the last time I saw him out of the tank like that. 100%. Oh my god. 100%. That's looking nice. Oh, look at this tarpon. Look at him. I might not even give him the jelly. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Look at the arowana. He's actually friendly. Most arowanas would have bit me by now. Oh yeah, this is a very friendly arowana. Not trying to jump or anything. They're not stressed. They're just chilling. All right, guys, let's pack them up. Time to bring them back to the wild world of Farley. And maybe Joey Slam's house. My boy Tank, Tank Diaz. I appreciate you. I appreciate. I appreciate you. Yeah, yeah. Guys, if you haven't already, subscribe to his channel. He makes people happy. Look, I was sad about marijuana. He brought up my day. He's happy. He's happy, Farley. I appreciate you, brother. So we made it to our boy Joey's house. I put the tarpon in the bucket real quick. Tarpon's doing A-OK. -okay. Now to drop it in the front door. Ooh, he's a feisty one. A-OK. -okay. It's your boy Wild Wolf the Father. Hey, it's your boy Joey Slam. Uh-oh. <laughs> It is a present for you, my friend! What is this? It's it crazy. is a present! You didn't hear me the first time? Yeah, yeah! That's amazing, bro. Alright, my Walden people, this Oscar is ready for Catfish Kingdom. The reason I'm gonna have to move him to Catfish Kingdom is because, well, we kinda have to grow up the arowana just a little bit more. So, he's big enough. So, about to scoop him up, and he hurt us. Do I got him? Oh, he's a big boy. And there's glare, and he knows what's up, and yeah, it's difficult, guys. It's difficult. Okay, I failed this. Please. Oh my God! Look at look at how beautiful this Oscar is. Oh. All right, duckies. It's time for you to go. Oh, he's dancing. He's dancing, dancing around, dancing around, dancing. Oh, uh, look at this beautiful Oscar. Look at the color. All right, my Walden people, this is a ruby Oscar. Look at how beautiful this ruby Oscar is. Uh, I grew him from like two inches, and now he's a big boy. 
Ah, into the oh, and there you go. The tank, as well as Catfish Kingdom, same temperature. And hopefully we'll see him again one day. This, look at this gorgeous, gorgeous arowana. This Artemis II, looking oh so clean and beautiful. All right, guys. We're not gonna put him in Catfish Kingdom because he's not that big. I don't want him getting eaten. And I want him just to grow maybe two to three more inches. And he'll do so into the 75 gallon tank with tender love and care. And power feedings by your boy, Wild World of Farley. Dr. Wild F. All right, let's, All right, let's grab him. Oh, he's a feisty one. Okay. Don't wanna hurt him, just let him be comfortable. Okay, the water temperatures are around the same. Now I'm just gonna release them. Oh, who's a pretty, pretty fish? Take a look at that. Got a new king to the castle. All right, like I mentioned, guys, just gonna let him get just a little bit bigger until he's ready for Catfish Kingdom. All right, my water people, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Shout out to my boy Tank Diaz, guys. If you're not subscribed, like I mentioned before, Subscribe to his channel. You got nothing to lose, and you have nothing but great content to watch. All right, my Walton people. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Until next time, stay wildin'. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, you viewer. Before you go, I want to say thanks for watching. Apart from that, if you haven't already, subscribe, give me a like, and of course, stay wildin'.